to watch the moon. mind if I get out of this rain? No problem. Who are you? I'm Tudza. I'm Sagwa. This is Fufu. Uh, we were just about to have a snack. Oh, mooncakes. The gift of the Jade Rabbit. Uh, the Jade Rabbit? I never heard that one. You're kidding. Where do you think mooncakes come from? I thought they came from Cook. We eat them with our family during the Moon Festival. I once heard they were used by soldiers a long time ago to send secret messages. I guess there are lots of mooncake stories. We tell the Jade Rabbit one in my family. Well, for obvious reasons. We sort of made it up, but it's really great. Do you want to hear it? Sure. Sounds good. Okay, close your eyes. Many, many years ago, the moon was inhabited by a beautiful moon maiden and her best friend, the Jade Rabbit. The goddess and the rabbit lived in a beautiful palace. Are you seeing it? Yeah. yeah. The Jade Rabbit spent all of his time grinding magical moon medicine into round cakes that were scattered everywhere. Wow. Is this a good way to listen to a story or what? Yeah, and so many mooncakes. <laughs> faster, Taylor! You were so faster! How can I look my best if my robes are tattered? Psst. Rabbit Kid, I thought Jade Rabbit lived here with Moon Maiden. He does. That's Mean Thing. I'll get to him in a minute. Hurry up, Jade Rabbit! I need more of your delicious cakes to keep me healthy forever! Yes, Mean Thing. Um. Have you considered my request? For me to see my best friend, Moon Maiden? It's been such a long time. Just keep making more cakes. Now, about Mean Thing. <laughs> For years, Jade Rabbit and Moon Maiden lived fun and happy lives together. But one day, evil Mean Thing, who had heard of the magical healing cakes made on the moon, and did the worst thing anyone could do to two best friends. <laughs> he kept them apart. Jade Rabbit, I just heard. That is so awful. Who are you? How did you get here? I'm Sagwa, and I'm just listening to your story. And this is Fu... Where'd he go? I hope you haven't eaten any cakes. I mean, things very greedy. If even one was missing, uh, he would be furious. Mm. Mm. Did you try these mooncakes, Sagwa? Oh, they're yeah. delicious. Oh. Oh. You have to leave right away. If Mean Thing finds out what you've done, you don't want to know what he'd do. Three million nine hundred and ninety-nine thousand nine hundred and ninety. I am missing one cake. Oh, somebody will pay for this. Oh no! That's somebody is me. Wait! It's only a story, Fufu. Just open your eyes. What happened? Don't you want to hear the rest? No way! I'm about to become moon dust. 
<laughs> Don't worry. A hero is on his way. Just close your eyes. Don't be scared. And no more snacking. <gasps> Where did you... <laughs> Never mind. Ready? Into that room. Quietly. Just jump in the hole and you'll land back on Earth. Quickly now. But we just got back. We want to see the rest of your story. This is no time for... <gasps> Silly axe keeps getting in my way. He's the hero? Hello, moon creatures. I am the woodcutter, Wugong. Uh, yeah, that's great. But why have you come here? I have been sent to spend eternity on the moon. But I bring sad news from Earth. There is a mysterious illness there that has no known cure. The moon cakes! They have special healing powers in them, right? Yes, but they're trapped here by the same evil magic that keeps me from the Moon Maiden. Mean thing! But this is an emergency! Perhaps if I talk to this mean thing... <laughs> Please, ask me again! Very well. Won't you please take some mooncakes to the sick people on Earth? <laughs> Rabbit, go make more cakes! So you can return to Earth with them? No, so I may eat them. All this laughing has made me hungry! <laughs> Hurry! As for you, woodcutter... And you'll send down all the cakes they need as soon as I chop this tree down. That's right. Just as soon as it's no longer standing. <laughs> what is he up to? <laughs> Shh. Just watch. You won't be able to do it, you know. Oh, really? I am the most powerful woodcutter on Earth. Oh, and you are the most beautiful woman in the universe. Hey, uh, two uh, those two really went all gushy uh, over each other? Sorry, my family kind of loves love stories. We totally made this part up. I am the Moon Maiden. Is it true? Are the people on Earth really sick? I am afraid so. Jade Rabbit's mooncakes would surely help. Will you do me a favor? Anything for you, my mellifluous moonbeam. Get this message to my friend Jade Rabbit. He'll know what to do. Oh, brother. She is a vision of light. The top ten things that make me great. Number one, my teeth. No, that way. This way. What does that fool think he's doing? Eh, it doesn't matter. He's stuck here. Forever. <laughs> okay, I'll admit it. We're lost. We're not lost. We just have no idea where we are. Well, maybe if we follow these silly rabbit tracks, we'll find Jade Rabbit. Hmm, clever idea. Hiding a message inside the cake. She says we must send the cakes to Earth. But the only one who can take the cakes off the moon is Mean Thing. He'll never agree to that. Who says he has to agree, huh? Get me the tailor. Here's the plan. <laughs> Get those mooncakes ready, mean thing! I'm chopping this tree down! Careful with that needle, Taylor! Ah, just what I need. A freshly made cake! What's this? A message? From the Emperor! What does it say? I have been summoned to Earth! 
The Emperor wants me to be part of his royal court! I must go at once! Goodbye, pitiful moon, and all who live here! <laughs> He has no idea the good he is about to do. It's working! You are so smart! A real hero! It was Moon Maiden's idea to trick Mean Thing away. Now you two had better hurry if you want to lift home. Goodbye! Goodbye. ended up bringing to Earth the cakes that cured the mysterious illness. And in so doing, no longer felt the need ever to be mean again. And Moon Maiden, Jade Rabbit, and Wu Gong spent the rest of the time happily playing on the moon. Wow, that was a great story. Well, seeing as the rain stopped and I'm almost home, I, um, suppose I'd best be off. Wait! <gasps> we really want you to have half our moon cake. I thank you. We all thank you. We? Who's we? I don't know. Let's find out. Look, rabbit tracks, just like in the story. Half a moon cake won't be enough for all those rabbits. Excuse us, but we weren't that hungry and, well, would you all like the rest of this moon cake? It's a great night for sharing. Stories and moon cakes. are just okay. I think they're great. Oh. Pretty cool cat, huh? hi -ya! Ha! Looks like he knows some gung fu! hi -ya! Wow! hi -ya! Wow. Hey, guys! Did I mention there's gonna be a big feast after the noodle shop opening? Yeah, and those lion dancer kids get rewarded with food! Hey, we should have our own lion dance! No way! So I was thinking... If we have our own lion dance, we'll get tossed some tasty scraps. Hey, Wan Tom, that's a great idea. Huh? Huh? He's looking for what? A costume the daughters used to play with. Looks like an old lion and some new moths. Now we can have a lion dance. the head. No way. One Tom's bigger. He should be the head. But it was my idea. Sorry. Let's get this costume down to the alley and see what he says. Care for a fine carp skeleton, Wantong? If it's protein you want, I know where the best hundred-year-old egg is, Wantong. Hey, Wantong! Who's a little cat? And why is he dragging an old rug around? I heard what you said about performing the lion dance at the noodle shop opening, and that I... That was a great idea, wasn't it? Yeah! Anyway, I'm Dongwa and... A really, really great idea, Wontong! And I'd like to help with the dance. See? Here's a lion costume. 
You shouldn't have. A lion costume? For me? It's for us, actually. I was hoping we could do a lion dance together. Hey, everybody. My new pal and I are gonna dance at the noodle shop opening. <laughs> Did you hear that? He called me his new pal. Oh, brother. What are you doing? Practicing. <sighs> Why are you jumping around? I'm not jumping around. I'm working on our wine dance. Wontoms in mine. <laughs> are you uh, sure you know what you're doing with this wonton guy? Are you kidding? He's my new pal. Hiya! Hiya! Then, after my double jump, I do a big kick in the air. While you're up in the head, flapping the ears, like this. Wontom? Hey, hey, Wontom. Uh, yeah. Keep up the good work, kid. See? He likes it. Of course he likes it. You're doing all the work. Hey, uh, good buddy, if we could just work on our dance together for a little while. Whatever, kid. Here, want a shrimp? Uh, sure. Tell you what, some cats down at the docks are having a fish feast for me. Want to come? New pal? Great, sure, you bet. Put my costume away, okay? Wontom and I are taking off. And brush down the main. Thanks. By the way, you're all invited to the noodle shop opening tomorrow night. Thanks. I never turn down free food. Tell me about it. I gotta grab me another fish. Wontom is gonna do a lion dance behind the kitchen. We'll all get the best scraps. Uh, hi. You know that lion dance? It's my costume. Actually, I'm in the lion dance, too. I'm Wontom's tail. You're working with Wontom? He must know a ton about him. Well, of course. I'm his new pal. I heard Wandom invented some new moves for the dance. Has he shown them to you? Well, I actually invented... New moves? <gasps> yeah. Watch this. Ah. Great stuff, Wandom. Um, I could show you guys some of my moves if... Your lion dance sounds great. Can't wait to see it. Stay out of my way with that tail. But what about all the moves I worked on? Don't worry. Everything's gonna be great. Hey, everyone. If the lion dance isn't a success, a new shop won't have good luck. If it isn't a success, we won't have good luck. noise what do you mean i love noise make way for my new best pals <laughs> here play away best pals i thought i was come on kid shake that lion tail 
Tom's Lion Dance. <laughs> I can't believe you're letting him take all the credit. Who cares? But it was our costume, Dongwa. And you did most of the dancing. He just kind of shook a lot. You're just upset Wan Tom didn't pick you to be in his dance. What? I don't think so. See you later. We sure were a hit, huh, new pal? Guess we'll want to practice that last move some more tomorrow, right? That's it for lion dancing, kid. Time for something new, right, guys? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! yeah! But... Some old buddies and I are hopping a junk tonight for the sugar cane fields. Gonna catch us some rats. See you around, my friend Tail. <laughs> 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 yeah, uh, see ya. Jet Jet, want to try some lion dancing? Uh, nah, uh, I'm still too full from yesterday. This will be great. I've always wanted to explore the ruined temple. Yeah, Fufu knows the creepiest places. I, I promise not to be scared. There you are. Look, I know I was acting a little weird yesterday, but what do you say we do some lion dancing now? Sorry, new pal. Maybe later. We already have plans. Come on, Shigua. Too bad you don't have time to come with us. Bye, Dongwa. But I... But I do have the time. Being half a lion isn't nearly half as fun. Now what am I gonna do? <laughs> Lion dance. I remember you. You're Wan Tom's pal. I mean, I'm Dongwa. Hi, Dongwa. I'm Ling. How about teaching me some of those dance moves? Sure. Hop in. Okay. Now, when I flap my ears, you kick with the hind leg. Like this? Yeah, Ling. You got it. Ha <laughs> ha